The man police believe shot a father who was trying to defend his family during a carjacking went before a judge today. A Darian Christie accused of shooting Armando Velasquez. This video only on two of the 19 year old suspect after he was taken into custody. Channel 2's Brennan Walker reports a gun found in Christie's car may be linked to the shooting involving Velasquez. Authorities first encountered a Darian Christie during a traffic stop, according to probable cause documents. Also in the car, according to court, a gun, a 45 caliber. We're told the same gun that was used to shoot Armando Velasquez. Also in the car, a friend of Christie's who ratted him out as the gunman. Mr. Christie, you're charged with aggravated robbery. A Darian Christie is the alleged trigger man who shot Armando Velasquez as the two fought over Velasquez's car. That, according to probable cause paperwork against the 19 year old. Last night, Harris County sheriffs arrested him. Christie and another man allegedly ran up to Velasquez, his fiancee Sarah Harris, and the couple's one year old daughter Emma. The family had just returned home on the east side last week when, according to probable cause, Christie pointed a gun at them, demanding their car. Velasquez refused, even fought his attackers, all while baby Emma was in the back seat. The defendant chased the complainant around the vehicle and fired several shots at him, striking him several times. Six times, in fact, according to Velasquez's fiance, who watched in horror. He was still charging at them with six bullet holes. Channel 2 spoke exclusively with Harris. Meantime, we stopped by an address listed for Christie, spoke to a man who identified himself as Christie's stepfather, though he wouldn't speak on camera. He confirmed Christie played football for Kashmir High School as well Blinn Junior College before dropping out. The stepfather would not speak on the allegations against Christie, who in the meantime is being held in the Harris County Jail without bond. In downtown Houston, I'm Brandon Walker, KPRC, Channel 2 News.